Hey coach, welcome back. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to grow your business and spend less time training. There's gonna be two ways that I can help you today, all right? So here's step one. Step one is you look at the pricing that you have right now and you look to double it, okay? And when you do that, you're gonna be able to make more money and spend less time training because now you're going to be getting more committed, more qualified clients into your training program, right? And when I say double it, I mean, whatever you have right now, multiply it by two. Do not try to add like $50 or $25. I would increase the price. But when you do that, you increase the value of what you provide. Do not just increase the price. So if you've watched our other video where I talked about why you shouldn't undercut any competitors, that goes along with what I'm talking about right now, because when you multiply the price, the value needs to be multiplied as well, okay? That would be step one. That can allow you to step away from training and just grinding it out every single day at the field, okay? Simply do that. And the way I like to do it is I like to determine my schedule. I wanna know, all right, this, this month, I wanna train this much every single week. And I break down the whole week what are the days I wanna train? How many hours do I wanna train? And then I do the math and I think, okay, great. If I wanna train that many hours, how much money do I wanna make based on the clients that I have, okay? That is very simple to figure out. Um, take action on that. Step two is if you wanted to train less and also profit more, you should think about having a group training program, similar to having classes within your program to where multiple players are coming every week. So let me give you a great example. Let's say you have 10 clients right now and those clients that you are training, it's all private one-on-one -on -one training. And let's assume each one of those clients comes one time a week. So you're looking at 10 sessions a week that you would be, you know, let's say they're hour sessions, so that's 10 hours that you're spending week after week. That's 40 hours that you'd be spending per month, okay? That's with 10 players. Now, if you wanted to leverage your time better, what you could do is transition all of those 10 players into group training. This way they come on one day at one time. So now you are maximizing your time on the field. This way you have 10 players at one session, right? And think about it this way. The 10 players in one session, that would be group training. The price of that would be a lot more affordable than private training. It should be. If it's not, then you need to correct that. But what you want to do is have things set up to where those parents of the players that you're working with, so your clients, they're all coming on one day at one time. And this way you can start to leverage your time on the field or at the park or at the gym, right? Because if you're doing everything privately, now you know that you're going to be spending more time with more players versus less time with more players, okay? And let me give you a great example here. Let's say your private training program, it's $200 a month, all right? So if you had 10 clients, you would be spending, like I said, 40 hours per month training to make $2,000 a month, right? Now, if you have it set up with group training, let's say your group training is $100 a month, okay? Now, you're gonna be spending four hours a month making 1,000 bucks, okay? You have 10 clients now paying $100, now you're working four sessions. So think about the math there. That is 10% as much as you would have worked, okay? That is a huge difference. Let's think about it on a larger scale. What if you had 10 groups of 10 players and now you're working 10 sessions a week, which is the exact same amount as you would if you were doing 10 sessions for private training, okay? Now it's a little bit harder to manage 100 kids versus 10, obviously, right? but you'll be able to, I mean, if you had 100 kids, you had, um, it was $100 a month, that's $10,000 a month. That is not that far off if you have your marketing down, if you have the systems in place, if you know how to communicate with parents, you have a consistent marketing message go out, going out every day, right? So this is how you can leverage your time with that, by having group training. And if you think about it for private training, like I said, double your price, double your value. You do that, and your business is going to double or triple over the next month if you install that, right? And if that helps you out, right, I would love to chat with you on the phone. And I want you to test that out. Test it out today, right? Whoever you talk to next, if you're talking to Ms. Jones on the phone, 
be bold about your pricing, be bold about your value, right? And if you need to transition from private training to group training, you should start making those changes now. Do not wait. The longer you wait, all right, the less likely it's gonna happen, okay? But I want you to test this out, do it, and once it works, I want you to hop on a phone call with me. I wanna see how I can help you on a much more advanced level with your business. And that is what our mastermind is all about. So simply head over to our website, go to www.buildmysportsbiz.com. At the top of the page, it says mastermind. I have a free phone call set up where it's a strategy call. I ask a lot of questions. I see where you're at. I see if and how I can help you. All right, it's very simple. I've done this hundreds of times already with coaches all around the world in every single sport imaginable. Simply head over to our site and we'll get started there. I'll see you next time.